Okay, so I just left this spot. That spot. So I just left that spot for breakfast right there. And I decided to get out this morning because it wasn't raining to check out some stuff in Portugal. It looks like they got some little shop going on here. Little Sunday market. So let me all check it out. Doubt if I buy anything, but I'm just looking. Yeah, a little Sunday market. Today is Sunday. The weather is, you know, coming from Panama, it's supposed to be 70 today, but I think it's still in the 60s. I have a jacket on. It's not that bad. All right. I don't see anything interesting. Don't see anything interesting. <laughs> Sun's coming out, which is nice. It was raining all day yesterday. And I kind of stayed in my Airbnb all day yesterday. And when I saw that the forecast called for no rain today, although I got my umbrella just in case, I decided that I was going to get out and go for a walk. So that's what I'm doing. Yeah. Don't really have a destination. I think I'm going to try to find the... Uh, there's some kind of um, sculpture garden. I think I'm going to try to find that. Uh, yeah. <clears throat> I ordered some food from a, a private caterer. But I don't have to pick that up till 2 o'clock. So I got a couple of hours to kill. So that's what I said I'm going to do. Kill a couple of hours. So y'all just taking a walk with me. <coughs> In Porto. I think if I... Um, I'm trying to head towards the city center to pull my phone out and see which direction <laughs> I should be walking in. Yeah. Somebody trying to be an Instagram model. Y'all see that? Yeah, Instagram models everywhere. Two hundred and eighty years of history. Okay. There's a fountain. Let's see if I can adjust myself, figure out where I need to be. It's a beautiful wow. Look at that building. That's pretty cool. Let's see if I can scan up so y'all can see that. Look at that building. Wow, y'all see that? That's pretty cool. Yeah. That's a pretty cool building. So, I'm going to take a walk. I'm trying to figure out where I am. I'm thinking I'm walking in. The pedestrian street, it comes all the way here. Oh, I think it is. Oh, wait a minute. The bookstore down here. The famous bookstore is down here. Alright. It's telling me to go left, but I'm not going to go left. Oh, is that the sculpture garden? Oh, this is a famous bookstore. Oh. I'm going up here. 
Oh, this must be the University of Porto. That's pretty. Look at that down there. Y'all, I'm just out here walking. So y'all seeing what I'm seeing. Whole crowd of people. It's all kinds of tour groups out here. Yeah. Head north on Rua do Duder Ferreira da Silva toward Praga de Gomes de Cheiro. I'm gonna go up here and see what's up here. Oh, that's like that's another um Look how pretty that building is over there. Oh the gardens. Oh you know what? There's a sculpture park down here, so let's walk down here and look at the sculpture park. Yeah. So y'all just taking a walk with me. It's supposed to be a sculpture park down here. I'm actually going the wrong direction that I want to go in, but. Head north on Rua de Duda Ferreira da Silva toward Praga de Gomes de Xera. That was telling me to turn around. <laughs> but I want to see the sculpture. Uh, The sculpture garden. Yeah, I'm gonna go here and cross at the um, cross at the pavement. I don't know if jaywalking is a thing here. Oh, I see some people jaywalking, so I'm gonna jaywalk too. This is probably really pretty in the springtime. You know, it's fall here now, so. <clears throat> oh, that's the University, University of Porto right there. <clears throat> yeah, I don't think there's much of a sculpture garden here because for one thing, it's fall. Oh, there are some sculptures, I guess, but. I don't think it's worth walking around looking at. <clears throat> so, what we're going to do, look at all these groups out here. My goodness. All these tour groups. <clears throat> what we're going to do, we're going to make our way over to this area. Oh, that's a nice clock. Which way is it telling me? I was telling me to go back that way. But I want to take a picture of this clock. <coughs> it's amazing. Oh, Casa Oriental. All kinds of little restaurants around here. I don't know if y'all can see all those colors that I see. So pretty. Wow. Yeah. Y'all see that clock? Let me see if I can zoom in. Let me practice my zooming. Nope. Zoom. Oh, here we go. There we go. I'm trying to zoom in on a sculpture. But anyway. 
can walk through this way. <clears throat> There's another, um, looks like a, uh, another Sunday fair of some sort. Yeah, lots of people out here. As you can see, oh, that's a restaurant. Oh, that's a cool photo. Hopefully with nobody in it. Okay, that's a restaurant. <laughs> Okay, I need to pull my hat out. Sun's coming out. Pull my hat out and take off this jacket and put it around my waist. Somebody's down here singing. Um, I think this is the oldest, one of the oldest bookstores in the world. I think it's where the crowd is at, waiting to get in. Thinking this line, yeah. See this line right here? They waiting to go into the oldest bookstore. It's pretty small, but one day I'm going to do this. Not today, though. He sounds pretty good, doesn't he? Yeah, all these people are waiting to go into the bookstore. That line of people. Oh, oh wow. Did the line go all the way back there? He walked down here. It's crazy. All those people waiting to go in line to the bookstore. One day I'll go in it, come here in the morning when it's, uh, this is crazy. Wow. All these people waiting in line to go in that bookstore. That's a little crazy. Yeah. So you got to get tickets, uh, you know, when they first open. I think that's the trick. And try to come when it's not not tours if there isn't any there's a such time so i'm walking down a pre pedestrian walkway i think yeah i don't know any of the street but oh where's it telling me to turn i'm just killing some time actually And taking y'all with me for the stroll. Yeah. Oh, it's telling me to go around this curve. Cool. Somebody burning up something. Yeah, it's telling me to go around here. If I see a little store that's interesting, I might stop at. Is that a free church? 
Yeah, I'm supposed to turn down this way. Where are those people going to? Oh, you know what? I think I'm going to climb those stairs. Is that... Let me go look at that sign. See if that's something you got to pay for or what. They probably ain't got too many free things here. But lots of crowds. <laughs> Gotta pull my hat out. Oh yeah, it's five euros to get in. There's probably too many people in there. It's a kind of light show museum. Who's singing? Oh, she's singing. at the walkway. These cars are coming by here really fast. Starbucks everywhere. This building. Bon domingo. How are you? Ah, pero siéntense. Bon domingo. ¿Cómo se dice? Pero bueno o bueno. Sí. Vale, estoy platicando aquí. Okay, y'all, this video is not some professional whatever. I'm just walking. And I think I'm supposed to be going this way. I got my phone as a map in one hand. Oh, that's a cool pit down this street. Look at that street down there. Is that cool? <laughs> I'm out here by myself, solo tours here in Porto. Yeah, and I'm like exhausted from my six hour like delay time zone. So I know I look very tired. But I hope you guys are enjoying a stroll with me. 
I might stop at something, I'm not sure. But right now, I am walking. I see something I want to stop at. There's all kinds of stores. Oh, there's the official, oh, there's Ronaldo. <laughs> oh, Ronaldo's statue, sweetie. Yeah. That's cool. Wax statue. I got all kinds of shops down here. Cafes. I tell you, pastries are like a thing here. Bread. Oh my gosh. I've been trying to eat oatmeal every morning because I've been eating a lot of pa pastries. Which they're delicious, but jeez. I'm gonna be hungry by the time I'm walking off this breakfast. But that's where I came from. Oh, let me turn around and take a picture of that. That's a pretty cool photo. Uh, these are the trash cans where people dump their trash and I guess they come around and empty them on a certain day I guess uh, discope. I don't know let me get in front of this lady Oops. she ain't even looking I'm trying to like avoid her like a collision okay I think I'm turning left at this street down here. Oh, I gotta put another battery in. So this is a good way to stop, I guess. Good point to stop because I'm at the 24. I'll let it roll. Groups of people all over the place. Yeah. I'm supposed to go that way. So they're doing some construction to this area. And I'm just walking around. I wonder if that's a hotel. Looks like a hotel. Wow, look at these people pulling their suitcases. They are way too elderly for that. My goodness, call up Uber or Bolt. It's too much. Listen, if y'all need help, like assistance at the airport, or don't be ashamed of that. I see too many people at the airports like struggling when they should be calling for help. When I need help, believe me. I am not going to be ashamed to ask for it. So, make sure you take care of yourself. Don't be overdoing it. Don't be trying to struggle through carrying a whole bunch of bags. It's crazy. There's a McDonald's. Outdoor cafes, as you see, are a big thing here. As long as I guess it's not raining, people are going to be sitting outside. And I think I'm going this way. I don't know if these people are backpacking the Camino. Because they got walking sticks and stuff, so they might be part of the 
the popular Camino del Real walk. Not sure, but oh, we're at City Center because I'm going towards the Porto sign. So I'll get that on tape, and that will be where I end this lovely uh, recording at least for today <clears throat> so y'all took a walk through the neighborhood with me um, I don't really know what neighborhood I was in but <laughs> we are in the city of Porto and we're heading on an incline here we're heading towards the city hall There's probably a bunch of people in front of the Porto sign but we'll try to get a shot we will try Whew. I gotta come back in the morning walking up the hill right now so if I'm puffing and puffing that is why. I'm waiting for walk signals because I am not trying to have <coughs> No incident. But it looks like they're doing some main construction here on one of the main squares here. This is a metro stop. Getting my steps in. go there to get some fruits and vegetables. The bio, I think that's what it's called, market. Yeah, let's see if I can do that. Alias, Aliados, Alidos, Metro. Hotel Chic. taking pictures as you can see but that's City Hall practice my zoom skills that is City Hall you can see those folks up there taking photos in front of the zoom sign. So I'm going to see. Heading start Boca General 
If I can find this market. that way. Okay, so it's down this way. holding the camera down. Down pedestrian street, forgot what it's called, but all the lights went on in the store. I think they all just came back on. Oh, what kind of store is that? I don't know, but as you can see, it is jam packed. I will, uh, if I live in this area, I'll definitely come early in the morning. This is. Uh, Very crowded with tours today. Very crowded with tours. This is a famous pedestrian street. Shops all up and down. I'm thinking about getting me something to eat so I can go back to the um, Airbnb. Well, let me walk on the other side. It's shaded. But, um, yeah, I think I'm going to turn around and go get me something to eat. Or maybe I'll walk to the um, Italian place later. Maybe that's what I'll do. Yeah. Okay, so I need to find a general spot so I can catch catch an Uber because there's no cars that really come down here. So I need to find a corner. Maybe I'll go up there. Or maybe I'll go back in the mall area and go up 
across. But as you can see, this is packed. Hmm, a lot of people are walking in this direction. What's down here? Maybe this is where I can catch an over. I'm following an unknown crowd that I don't even know. They're probably a tour group. <laughs> but anyway, there's all kinds of stuff. Oh, there's the ice cream place. Do I want ice cream? He on the phone. Ice cream. How tacky is that? Uh, nope. Probably not that clean. Probably not. Not that clean. Like they're ready for Halloween over there. All kinds of shops. Oh, that's cool. A shoe shop. Oh, this is like a square down here. Oh, that smells good. What kind of place is that? Oh, this is where they make the famous pasta la nita. Yeah, as you see, they are making them in there. See? He's filling them up. Do y'all see that? Hope so. Getting a glare. Alright, this is another pedestrian square. Looks like Alicante. <laughs> wow. I'm just walking. Don't even know where I am, but looking for a spot so I can catch the bolt and go back to the Airbnb. But I'm thinking I'm in the center of Porto. I believe I am. But I'm just walking. That's pretty freeing, actually, to just walk. Okay, what's in here? Is this that indoor market? Oh, it is. All right, well, since we're here, maybe I'll get something to take back with me. Yeah. This is an indoor market. As you see, hopefully this video comes out all right. I'm not zooming anything, y'all. I'm just walking. They got smoothies, all kinds of fruit and veggies. Mm, it smells delicious. It smells really good. Oh, they got a whole fish market over there. This be a cool place to come get your veggies. I wonder if it's expensive. Celery. Oh, they're probably individually priced. Oh, is that candy and seasonings? What is this? Seasonings? Oh, it is seasonings. Wow. All kinds of seasonings. That's pretty cool. Lemon pepper. Wow. All kinds of seasonings. That's pretty cool. Okay, this looks like a popular place. I'm trying to see what's going on here. Delicious. Oh, he's making Alfredo. He's making Alfredo, looks like. Oh, he's making 
taken out already. It's a nice camera. Oh, thank you. Where you get it? Online? Um, Amazon. yes. Amazon has everything, right? Yes. <laughs> What's the name of it? Uh, it's an Osmo. Osmo Pocket. Osmo Pocket? Mm-hmm. Let me check the name of it. I want to get it. Elizabeth? Osmo Pocket. Thank you. It's good. It is. You don't have to get your phone. It's you okay. can see. I know. It's easy to carry, too. Yeah. Alright, so they're making some pasta over there. Wow, this is pretty cool. Very cool market. As y'all can see, that pasta place is very popular. This is a mushroom place. They got a flower shop. How did I get something to take back with me? Something. What's this over here? It's very big, very spacious. But they probably got soaps and stuff over here. There's gelato, milkshakes. I'm not sure what she's selling. There ain't nobody buying. Oh, sardines. Well, the wine house is popular. Long line, peanuts. Okay, I'm gonna go on the other side. I'd like to get some dinner. I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna eat. A lot of olives. I don't think I ever buy olives. I don't eat them like that. I think I people over here eating. Most people are eating. This is cool. All right, I need some food. What do they have here? I need some food. Oh, it's like a little cheese plate. Different cheese boards. So people are walking around with glasses of wine. Then they have the fresh fresh meat section. Y'all, they got everything in here. Everything. When I say everything, I mean everything. Butchers. All kinds of stuff. What are they in line for? Oh, they're in line for wine. Wine is a big thing here in Porto. I guess eventually I'm going to have to try it because it's so popular. The Porto wine. Beautiful fresh flowers. Flowers are amazing. Okay, well, maybe I will get. I'm not sure what I'm gonna get, y'all. It smells so good. What do these people have? No. So good. Oh, fresh salads. Healthy food. Let's see what they got. Sweet salad. Balls. I think I'll get two veggie balls. <laughs> veggie balls. Get some salad. A quién le dan los 20 euros? Salad looks decent. Hmm. Well, I was thinking about 
getting some Betty balls. Two fifty. Maybe I get. Maybe I get some veggie balls. Smell good. Just a big potato. Potato, zucchini, and leek. Hmm. Interesting. These people got sandwiches. Whew, I can't eat that kind of meat. All this bread. Bread, bread, bread. Bread is king here. Everybody loves bread. Oh, these are sandwiches. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe and turn on your notifications so you don't miss my adventures here in Portugal. Got plenty more to come. Take care.